somewhere. No use. Where is she? A dryad dreams. Spellball! That's not much to go on. Oh well, we tried. Actually, the rhyme appears to contain valuable information as to where to begin our search using your new Beepo power. Oh, I know, Genie. I was trying to avoid getting sucked into someone else's problems again. Come on, read the room, would you?
Incredible. Well, thankfully, nothing's invisible to me. Now, let's go find those seeds.
<laughs> Thank you. The trees. Wow. Never. Glad to see everything turned out for the best. Now, if you'll excuse us, we... During Woodrow's poem, I stopped analyzing and and felt something. Really? Wow, that's unexpected. Beepo, are are you crying? No, of course not. A forest had lots of powdery mildews. One must have. Terra Flora, home to naturally sparkling mineral water springs, perennial flower prairies, not to mention the ever blossom tree. Surely, Jean, even you can't spoil my enthusiasm for visiting the Garden of the Galaxy. Unfortunately, I believe I can. Cursa's stronghold is now in range of our ship's instruments. Cursa has constructed a barrier of darkness energy around it that will prevent us from landing our spaceship there. Even if we do find enough purified darkness energy to reach it. And you, you must know a way. What? How's that? You know Bedrock. You know Midnight. There is something you are choosing not to tell us, isn't there? Listen! Ah, uh, about those flower prairies. It looks like we are going to see them in person. Uh, prepare for landing?
Flora's foliage is suffering. A drought is looming. Terraflora's famous water volcano, Mount Spout, has gone dormant. That voice. Her name is Jeannie. Our ship's artificially intelligent pilot and systems manager, and I am... Hmm, curse upon thee. Actually, while enjoyment of my duties is immaterial, I find them quite pleasurable, Mr... Curse me for an unmannerly pig. Whoa, steam power. Having the dining car run out of cucumber canapes is a trifling problem. That is a darkness tentacle. Boy, snub! However... Thank you, Mr. Sullivan. We will visit the Everbloom tree right away and see your train soon, I promise. I like Terraflora's cancer set, the planet shaped cheese ball cup. They signed some good crumble whackers in the off season.
I feel stronger. tree itself! We mean you no harm. In fact, we can help restore your majestic Everbloom to its natural efflorescing state! Yes, of course, oh great spirit of the Everbloom. Thank you. You won't regret it. singer who left it all behind to become an organic farmer. She got her start playing Roxy on the Gachapon Gang, a show about a teen rock band who turned into giant Gachapons to fight crime. Thank <laughs> you. 